Hi guys, Hi. Kevin Garnett, Julia Fox. Mm. How are you guys feeling? Well, how are you? Man, I'm so excited. I, I love the film. Um, okay. And I understand this is your first gig, Julia? Both of us, yeah. Oh wow, Kevin? I had like what? a little small part in something, nothing like this. Yeah, though. I mean, but yeah, Jules killed it. He killed it too, though. I mean, right. I don't think Kevin ever did, like I would do some not so great takes, but he uh, always did a a, a great so take. Uh, yeah, he, no, up. it's so true. I wouldn't, yeah, I wouldn't lie. It's true. What was more challenging, court or acting? Acting. Cause what? Acting. You know, basketball, you build yourself up. You know, you mm -hmm. lift weights, you run, you jog, you know, you You've do all this. You play, right. Yeah. You, you know, it's just, and then too, it's a passion. Acting, you're playing a character, and mm -hmm. that character has direction, and you have to follow that direction. Then you have to sync that up, and there has to be timing. From that timing, you have dialogue in that, and it, it's just so many layers to, you know, where you just, at, at, at the drop of a dime, you can forget, you know, okay. the line, or you can forget. And, but when you get it right, it's a flow, and then you feel it, and it flows, and you're Were just you going with it. Absolutely. Yeah, of course. Absolutely. I, yeah, well, yes. I felt like I wanted to. I felt like in being chosen for this part, I wanted to be able to uh, deliver and bring yeah. a certain level of which they was looking for and follow the direction. And Julia, you knew the Sapti brothers for a long yeah. time. Mm. This movie took 10 years to make. Mm -hmm. um, so did you have to actually like uh, do casting or because you knew yeah. them, you had the hookups, you got yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, no, I was like promised the role from day one. But you know, when, when you know the big studios got involved, they wanted a big name actress. Um, oh. So they really, really had to fight for me and I had to do a screen test and never having met Adam before, but we just clicked instantly. My character understood his character, mm. his character understood mine. I think that was really important. Um, and you know, they, they auditioned 300 more girls, but they kept coming back to mine. So it's really like mm. a miracle that, so, that wow. I'm even here. Do you know some names? Like, you know, I don't. don't. Okay. I heard through the grapevine, Lady Gaga, Scarlett what? Johansson, oh um, Jennifer Lawrence. At one point, I even heard Kim Kardashian and Pamela Anderson. So, um, but I never really asked, even though I had a friend that worked in their office, I never asked because I didn't want to drive myself crazy mm -hmm. doing the like compare and contrast. And I just didn't even want to know. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to do that to myself. And you get to kiss too. Different. <laughs> yeah. Beautiful guys. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Howard, played by Adam Sandler, and mm -hmm. The Weeknd. We didn't actually kiss, oh. though. Yeah, yeah, no. Mm. She doesn't actually cheat on Howard, which oh. everyone keeps saying I do. I don't, I really don't think so. I think mm. she's just a hustler and she saw an opportunity to make some money, and, and I think she was playing the shit out of The Weeknd, you know? <laughs> she was never gonna hook up with him, okay. but. She she pushed and pushed and pushed and as far as she could, you know, mm -hmm. and led him on to believe that. So Kevin, for you, was this part written for you? I heard. Uh, yes, yes, right? yes, yes. Do you know mm -hmm. your story? That's because I knew they wanted other basketball players. Yeah, so uh, this was originally written for Mari Stoudemire, and they, you know, uh, Benny and um, Josh are Knicks fans, and that was their favorite, I guess or the alignment of which they saw this. And he's Jewish, so yes. it kind of made sense with the Ethiopian yes. Jews. But for some reason, it didn't pan out, and then they went to Kobe Bryant, and we wrote the whole script for him, and he wanted to direct. I yeah. Think. And then they tried to go to Joel Embiid, who's down in Philadelphia, and he plays still, and it didn't line up to when they had to shoot. So then they went to retired players and saw me on the list. We had a meeting. The first meeting went really well. Then we had a second meeting. It went better than the first meeting, and then a couple of weeks later, they called and told me that I had the part. Mm. So I understood. So that That's alone amazing. felt pressure to be able to deliver, um, to be able to, you know, take this direction and give these guys what they were looking for from this character. Well, all I know is that this is the start of amazing careers for both of you. Well, thank you. And that you get The Rock and you get Adam Sandler, hey. right? Yeah. <laughs> <Congrats>. <laughs> thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.